she's eating mama's goatee. How come no milk's coming out of this thing? Yeah. Poor Joel, she's getting choked on. Eight. What's up guys? It is Dorothy, Devin, and Mason. You hear those little babies? They're all just hollering this morning. <laughs> Look at them, they just ran and got on Tushy. <laughs> so we're gonna take care of the animals. Mason's got some fruits and vegetables, or just vegetables, right? Yeah, just vegetables that need to go to the chickens. We're just gonna make sure everybody's good. Hey guys, y'all want some more vegetables? Get back. They love them tomatoes. Yeah, I know. They Look, they go after them. <laughs> just like, rip, just yeah, just toss it. Okay. They love that stuff. Remember we used to hang the, the big ones up? So Devin's gonna check on the eggs. I think the girls are back to a normal laying schedule ever since the snow apocalypse. They haven't been laying very well, which we can, oh, that's dirty. Well, we need to go get the egg basket, silly. I'll go get it. <laughs> There's like, look. Up while you, like, yeah, do you mind putting that on the counter? Mm -hmm. Actually, we'll rinse it out out here. Hold on to that, Mason. Okay. Look at those little eggs. They're all so clean. Those aren't. Uh -uh. Yeah. Those over there are poopy. And nothing, those are poopy too. So they're still sleeping in their nesting boxes, which is just crazy because and they sleep all on top of each other. I know, and they sleep all on top of each other and we don't know how to get that fixed and change that. So we're gonna have to figure that out. Looks like it. No, the ducks don't need water. Ducks are doing good. We need to change the pond water again. Daddy changed it a couple days ago. Okay. We're gonna go see Billy and Rip and we're gonna save the best for last. Our last guys are gonna be our little babies. Hey guys. Uh, can I just yeah. Rip, you wanna tell them what you did? Two days ago, Billy. No. You want to tell them what they did? Tell them what you did. What did you do? So Stephen came out and took care of the animals. Daddy came out and took care of the animals a couple days ago. I don't. I was going to town for something, and I came back and he had. I'll, I'll show you guys. He fixed a board next to the pigs' feeder so they don't get into the pig feed because they were able to squeeze their head into the cattle panel on the pig feeder or when the pigs push the feeder out they could get to it well we came home oh yeah daddy was helping me get a heavy package and we were looking and everybody was fine and then like on our way back from the road yeah. rip had her head stuck in the cattle panel how she, she's done it before she's done it once one other time she gets her head in there and it just fits in a square of that cattle panel. It's so dumb. Bye, Devin. But, I mean, she's fine. We got her out. Make sure you shut that back since the, they're running through the pasture. Look at all that green grass. Okay. We're really thankful that when all that snow and ice hit, it didn't kill all our grass because, let's see, it's March. We have one month and we're getting meat chickens, buddy. Oh. We're going to have some meat meat chickens again on the farm in one month I think it's like April 9th when we're supposed to get them oh wow so that'll be exciting and everything's already set up in their coop for them daddy helped do that we just got to move it yeah that's why I'm sitting there but of course they're in the brooder we're gonna put them where the babies are because by that time the babies should be out of there or at least the mamas will be out of there Kevin socks these guys also escaped yesterday yeah, Dead into you. Too. Or two days ago. Yeah, you got socks now too. Hey, bud. Hey. Oh, yeah. You like to smell. Hey, socks. Oh. Oh, that's gross. Why do you gotta do that next to me? Hey, mama. Are you pregnant yet? Can you tell me if you're pregnant? Because. I want some babies. I want some little piglets. Smell good? Kevin. You're so spoiled. Kevin! 
Come here, dude. Oh yeah, so this is that board. We just put a board up, board up next to it just so that way the goats can't get their heads yeah, I there. Think I was with Daddy when I put the board there. No, it was a couple days ago, I think. Or maybe. You got it? Oh, uh, well, the goats are coming, dude. You gotta lock the goats up first. So we still have to lock the goats into the other pasture because they'll get in. They're just, they don't let you really feed in here really well. Come on, Billy. So what we'll do, hey Mace, we'll go give them some feed first and it'll cause them to follow us. But yeah, it just makes it easier and then once we're done, we'll let the goats out as long as they don't get their heads stuck again. You get the eggs, buddy? Yes, ma'am. I didn't know you were going to do that oh, already. Coming. Coming to Let's see if they'll follow us. Oh! That's weird. Come on, guys. I know! Go get him! Go get him! <laughs> That's awesome. Good job, Mace. They're like, no! <laughs> Must get it in the hole. Sorry, guys. Can y'all hook it up? Yes, that goes... It's already on. I don't think so. No. No, I wouldn't. You would be hearing the ticking. Yeah, that's true. Good point, Mason. That weight. Get your hand off of it. <laughs> Hold on. You can't let it... There you go. Let's try it. Let's see if it'll work. It might ground out touching each other. Touch it. See if it works. No. How about you first? Let's see if Billy touches it. Well, I hear it. <laughs> I hear it. Yeah. Alright, I think we'll be good. Let's go. I'm gonna go feed our piggies now. There's a oh, weird goat now. I know, they've like <laughs> took it down to nothing. So today we're just gonna try to get caught up. See, I know Steven's got a lot planned. I know Devin decided to break the go kart. I didn't break the go kart. <laughs> no, it's just the uh, air filter, right? Yeah, just the air filter needs to be changed, so Steven's going to work on that and then a couple other small things around the property just to get caught back up because, you know, the entire week we were down, couldn't hardly do anything, couldn't function because it was so cold, wasn't it, Kevin? Let's see. Oh yeah, we can grab this hay over here that you're just walking on. Really? Right there with other hay. Yeah. I said, really? Billy! Yeah. Party goats! Oh, there you guys go. That little girl, by the way, she is definitely putting weight back on that leg. Which is awesome. Because you can't have an animal down like that. And if she wasn't going to get better, then you'd have to cull. I'm gonna go in on the other side first. What is this dude doing? What is she? Look, she's in the feed bucket. Is she actually eating it? That'd be a great thing if she was. This one bad for her. Hey, little girl. What you doing? Are you getting some food? You see their little horns? Don't yes, it's adorable. They're getting their little bee horns. But look, she's got weight all on that leg. Look how much. Mama, what's wrong? I know, they're so big. Look at their little horns. Hi. Is your little horns? Look at that. She's so cute. They're out of food on this oh, side. Oh. Yeah, they're both out of food. We gotta... But look, that's a great sign that that little girl was eating. Look. 
No, oh, just Jules. Yeah. I'll go get some. Thanks, buddy. Yeah, you can if you want. They eat in my ear the other day. I know, they eat everything. Jules, we're gonna get you some more, Mama. We're getting you some too, Tushy. Hey, buddy. Well, look how different he looks from this one. Oh, I know. That was gross. Tushy, get down. There you go. Y'all are so cute. Hey, little dude. We've got to come up with names for them. Are you trying to eat my pants? Yep. You can't reach it now. Look, she's eating mama's goatee. Look how the no milk is coming out of this thing. Yeah. Poor Jewel, she's getting choked on. Eight. Hey. Look, the babies are eating it. That's awesome. Mason, can you lock that door so they don't get out? Look, that's such great news. Because you guys are like five weeks old, I think, on Monday. It's so awesome to see. Which one's for the little one? Is that good? Is that good? Oh, gotta get some grain, then go to the milk. Gotta wash it down, huh? Yeah, I think they've been no. eating this more because um, Tushy hasn't really been letting them milk. No, Tushy lets them milk. It's just random. Eat it. No. Yeah. Here, here. See, look, Tushy's letting her milk right now. There you go, Tushy. There's food up here, too. Mmm, yum, yum, yum. Hey, dude. Or girl, sorry. Hey, little girl. <laughs> oh, you're so sweet. Which one's your favorite, Mason? That this one. one. Tushy's little girl. Hey. You can't bite Mine me. is definitely this one. <laughs> You're definitely my favorite. <laughs> yes, you are. You're my favorite. Hmm. You're such a fighter. Aren't ya? <laughs> 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 Everybody's fat and happy, huh? Mm -hmm. Especially Jules. You want to come in and help them? Uh, no thanks. No thanks. Hi! Don't eat my hair. You always eat my hair. Huh. <laughs> okay, I let you down. I let you down. <laughs> Have fun. I still can't get over how her curly hair is. You see it around her neck? I know he's got it too. Yeah, he's getting it too. That's so cool. I guess it's because Jules' hair is a little curly, like wavy, I guess. Yeah, Jules, so. why do you knock over the feed? Maybe, I was thinking maybe she does that to let the babies eat too. Yeah. Hey, there's another bucket in there like that, right? Hi. In the I shop? I don't know. Do you mind going to go look? Because we can pour some feed in that and the babies... For Preferably two. If there's two, that'd be great. Yes, yes. We're going to try to get it set up so the babies have access to the grain. Because, like, Tushy's babies can reach that grain if it's full like that. But, you know, once Tushy eats it down, they won't be able to eat it. Because we want to help encourage the weaning of these babies what? as soon and as early as possible. <laughs> that way we can get our mamas back out to pasture. And then, we're not really sure, we're probably going to leave the babies on one side for just a little bit longer. We'll just put them all together, that way we can keep a close eye on them. Instead of just turning them completely out into the main pasture. But what we can start doing is like we can put them in the pasture for a few hours during the day and then lock them back up at night. Just to keep them safe. I don't think they've mastered that yet, like figured out what you're doing. Like the mamas do. Thank you, Devin. Devin's such a hard worker. Yep. yep. We, the new lot, latch for that came in, so we'll get it switched out soon. <laughs> that was a funny one. Get out. Alright, we got some babies on feed. 
Oh, we got some mamas on feed. Look, come here. Look, right there. Yum, yum. That's so awesome to see. Jules, you've got your own bucket. You've got your own. There you go. Baby's just trying to get some milk. Look at that. It's so cute. Is that good? See that? Hard work. Well, guys, everybody is well and taken care of. It's really awesome to see that the babies are already eating grain, especially Jules's babies, because they're only, they're three weeks. They might be four weeks. Maybe it's four weeks for them and five weeks for Jules, Tushy's babies. I don't remember. I know. Tushy, Tushy's babies were born on the 1st, and Jules's babies were born on the 8th of February. Yeah, so Tushy's are... Five weeks tomorrow. Five weeks, yeah. yeah, so they're one week w away from being weaned, but um, that's dangerous. Well, I what's dangerous? I found it in there, and I almost stepped on it, and so I set it up there in case Daddy wanted. That off. Huh? What if he knocked that off? Well, I didn't think it would, but you're right. It probably would have fell off. But I found it inside Tushy's or Jules's stall. I can go put it in the back yeah. of the mule so we can take it to the trash. Thanks, buddy. Yeah, I almost stepped on it. But yeah, that's awesome to see that, like, Jules' babies are, uh, you know, they're two weeks away from, you know, technically being weaned. You can wean them as soon as you want. But that's great to see. Jules, that's pure laziness. I did not do that for you to lay there and just get fat. <laughs> that's for your babies. Well, I've seen her doing that. She did that with the hay, too. So yeah, that's awesome to see. And then we're getting eggs finally. We got about five today, right? Yeah. I just have to say thanks to Devin because he was a big help today, carrying all the heavy stuff, feeding everybody. And Does Max have food? Being willing to do everything. Yes, his is almost full. Max eats so slow. It's like he doesn't ever eat, but he eats all the time. He probably. He eats a lot of other bugs and yeah, stuff. Yeah, he... that, there's a bag in the back of the mule. Do you want me to put it in there for you? For what? Uh, for Max's His is almost full, buddy. Oh. Yeah, I don't think it'll fit, but thank you. You're welcome. Alright, we're gonna go and see what Daddy's up to. He was finishing up a couple things on our website, which, by the way, if you don't know, we ship all over the 50 states. And it was terrible because we had a couple orders the week of the apocalypse. We couldn't ship anything. Everything was so far behind, so we're grateful for, D for UPS, right? Mm -hmm. Especially for all of our Amazon packages we can get. It's like every day we're getting stuff from Amazon. Alright guys, well we love you and we will see you in the next video. <laughs>